Let's just try our best to win this now. And get another reenact the crime and another breach the multiverse in there. That would be pretty shway. We did get another one in there. Okay. Uh, Daring Wave Rider, alright. Now we reenact the crime. We did get another breach. We did get another breach. That is just beautiful. Okay. Breach the multiverse. Yes, please. I mean, it is kind of free, so let's go, baby. All right. <laughs> What up, brothers and sisters, and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Matches Malone. Thank you all so very freaking much for tuning in. I hope you have the most wonderful freaking day. Today I played something that is way too smart for me, but somehow I still managed to play it. I don't know how, but I freaking did it. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're still on the way to 44,444, so if you haven't done so already, 44 times subscribe to the channel. Make yourself 400,444 new, uh, you know, accounts and just slam it. Don't delete them afterwards, though. <laughs> but enough with the yammering. Let's get into it. Well, it's not too smart for me. Hammering. Today we're playing something beautiful. Reenact the crime. You already know it. You exile a non-land card in a graveyard that was put there from anywhere this turn. Uh, you may cast a copy without paying its mana cost. Doesn't matter what it is. A 12 mana Eldrazi. Yes, we can do it. But we're playing it together with this card that for some reason I always thought was bad. But in here it's amazing. The Daring Wave Rider. It's um, an otter wizard that uh, when it enters you may cast an instant or sorcery card with mana value 4 or less from your graveyard without paying its mana cost. If it would be put in your graveyard, you exile it instead. So it does the same as Reenact the Crime, but with incident sorceries that cost 4. And wait, Reenact the Crime does cost 4. So what we want to do is discard our Bridge the Multiverse, get it with the Reenact the Crime, mill ourselves something. If we have the Otter in our graveyard, already very, very good. If we um, now, you know, get another Reenact the Crime, we can cast whatever we want. Also like Awakening the Hall, returning all creature cards from your graveyard to the battlefield. And as we're playing two Immodern Recruiters, that can be very, very broken very, very fast. By the way, obligatory Dominic Maya art. So yeah, you just discard everything you want in your graveyard, like the Immodern Recruiter, your Daring Wave Rider, Valgavov the Terror Eater, your Funeral Room, all of that stuff. Reach the multiverse away, uh, your daring wave rider, hit the reenact the crime, steal something from them, you know. Now you play this, reenact the crime again, do the bridge the multiverse again that you hit with your own uh, freaking uh, the, the bridge the multiverse. So that's just an infinite loop. If you have Jace out, you just mill yourself for 20, make certain that you can do it. So you can have like an infinite freaking loop until your opponent's library is just empty and you win with mill. Or you attack in with the Immodane Recruiter giving everything haste. So let's just say that you have three Wave Riders out, a Valgavov, and two Immodane Recruiters. Now that is already 12 from this, plus 4 here, there we're on 16, plus the Valgavov Terra Eater. Then everything gets plus 1, so we will be way over 20 damage. Way over 20 freaking damage. It's going to be freaking amazing. We have Liliana to discard ourselves, we have Bitter Triumph to discard ourselves. Playing Rona's Vortex for the early game until we get to the Anoint with Affliction or a freaking deadly cover-up. Um, Matson the card that I'm absolutely able to say the name without any problems. Uh, you discard whatever for free and then draw a card. Don't get the treasure, but you're still freaking doing it. So it's very, very darn freaking good. I love it and so should you. And then, you know, just do the loop. Daring Wave Rider, Breach the Multiverse. Jace them, return to Jace, whatever, you know, just have fun. It is a very, very fun freaking deck. If you have Valgavoth out, while you play a Bridge the Multiverse, every single card that you mill with the Bridge the Multiverse is now yours. So you will be able to play all of those 10 cards, all of them, just again, for life. You know, you just have to pay life, doesn't matter, no. We will be having a lot of freaking fun with this. 
Collector's Vault can also help you hardcast stuff like the Bridge of Multiverse later. Um, Matza Lantli will also help you because you can now make colors in a number of permanent cards in your graveyard, which can be Artifact, Creature, Planeswalker, that's it. So you can make three mana for the low, low price of zero mana. So it's a kind of a Black Lotus if you want to, that you don't have to sacrifice. Uh, maybe I'm exaggerating a little bit. Uh, you can also have land. So we're on four. We're on four lands, uh, four mana if we freaking want to. Restless Reef, the same thing. You attack in for four uh, mill cards, very darn nice. Uh, together with the Bridge of Multiverse and the Valgavov, that makes the card even freaking better. So yeah, once more. The deck is super freaking fun, super strong, and it gets your opponent by surprise because nobody, and I repeat, nobody, expects the daring freaking wave rider so thank you all so very freaking much this is too smart for me maybe you can do it i'm Magis malone now we'll see you in those wave riding games we're up against andy factor once more if you go five games against mono red in a row it's just not fun it might be for some people, but for me it's just not fun. So now that we have the Anoint with a Fiction, I hope that we never encounter Mono Red again. That is just my hopes and dreams. Like, I've been streaming for 50 minutes. For 50 minutes. And I kid you not. I kid you not. 30 minutes of those were against Mono Red. Even more. 45. 45 minutes against Mono Red. It's beautiful. In a bad way. Okay, this deck is a little bit too slow for us. So we might be winning this. No questions asked. Deck might be just a little bit too slow against us. You like the Verge of Persistence? I mean, it makes sense. I'm passing here. There's no need to do anything. We'll just get rid of the Daring Wave Rider. We don't want that in our hand anyways. And depending on what I draw here, it's another land. I can just get rid of this. If they don't have creatures other than dolls, we're kind of alright, you know? Another Carrot Cake, okay. I'm just super annoyed with Mono Red. Being so freaking annoying. Alright. Once more, our daring wave riders need to be in our graveyard. We're fine with whatever here. Then we also have the board wipe, so yeah. They need to do some stuff here. Enduring Innocence. Go ahead, draw a card. That's fine with me. We'll activate here. Get rid of the Daring Wave Rider. Jeez, we're drawing a lot of land here. A lot of freaking land here. There's the Reenact the Crime, though. Okay, do we have enough? Do we have enough? We do have enough. We do have enough. So... Let's just try our best to win this now. And get another reenact the crime and another breach the multiverse in there. That would be pretty sure. We did get another one in there. Okay. Uh, Daring Wave Rider, alright. Now we reenact the crime. We did get another breach. We did get another breach. That is just beautiful. Okay. Breach the multiverse. Yes, please. I mean, it is kind of free, so let's go, baby. All right. <laughs> that is, like, super good. I need to see what uh, we have in there. Deadly cover-up. Well, in that case, let's take Jace. Exiling you here. How many do they have? 29. So we win next turn with Jace. That is absolutely alright. Yo, Samantha Dashing, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. 
It's not our main game plan, but hey. I wish the developers would ask me for input. I wish they would. I would tell them that their deck ideas are just stupid. Absolutely stupid. Okay, what are you doing? Destroying that one? Why? You go ahead and do that. See if I care. They already lost the game. They don't even know it. But they already lost the game. Wow, what a fun freaking combo. A Christmas, how do you like the new emotes? No blocks. I literally couldn't care less. You're outclassed. Literally couldn't care less. <laughs> okay, boom. There you go. <laughs> if a deck doesn't beat us on turn two, we actually win. Let's go, baby. We're up against the magician. Oh, the magician. Opponent's going first. I don't like it, but I do like our hand here. So let's keep it. Let us see what they're playing. Please don't be mono red. They're also mono white. Okay. So we only have mono red and mono white. Is that what's happening now? Oh, it's Boros. Okay, all right. It is Boros. Goodbye, my friend. I hope you enjoyed your short stay. I hope you did. If they have high noon, we're pretty screwed. If they do have high noon, we're pretty, pretty screwed. Dollmaker's shop. Okay. All right, you do that. I don't want the land anymore. I need answers. I need answers. It's Krav's Hive. We do have the deadly cover up here. Let us see what we draw. Now I kind of still need another land, right? War leaders call? Okay. There is the other land. I don't really need it yet. What do we have in here? Land? Creature? I need to buy myself time. Time to crack the land. Jace is pretty good here. So let's play Jace. See what happens next. Emotions are distractions. Focus on the, the data requires. Another deadly cover up. Okay. So, we just need one little lucky hit here. Ooh. Well, that kind of sucks. You're going face, though. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, we need to find a land here. We can cast this jackpot. Absolute freaking jackpot. So let's try to be a little bit lucky here, shall we? Freaking shall we? We're doing it by milling ourselves three times. Just to uh, guarantee that we can hit something good, you know? That was very, very good. Alright, now let's hit some more stuff. Like the Bridge the Multiverse, very, very good. Uh, Daring Wave Rider. Uh, yeah, Eternal Wanderer is also fine. 
Now we can play the reenact the crime. Play not a breach the multiverse. Okay. <laughs> There was even another breach the multiverse! Oh my god! I'm t <laughs> First of all, I'm dying here! Second of all, I'm telling you! If they don't destroy us on turn two, we're looking so good! Get out of here! We're up against and and one. Opponent's going first, so I think we're playing up against Mono Red again. Just saying. Just saying. That's insane. X13 is insane. Look, it's mono red. Oh no, it's not. It's not mono red. Okay. Paint me surprised. You think they're just enchantments? All right, we have almost everything we want here. Almost everything. Do they get haste? Wait, I wasn't even aware of that. How much does this have worked too? I wasn't even aware of them getting haste. We're discarding here. Right now we still want the otter. Yo, Moose Thompson! Thank you so much for the eight freaking months! You live in the UK now? When is your band's next uh, concert? It will be uh, very, very soon. But in Germany. Alright. What is this weak sauce? I just played a Jace, that's it! The heck was this? Why are you... Get out of here, dude! Get out of here! Oh my god, that's true! They're manifest, they're not tokens! In my head, they were tokens for a second, yo! My lord, Krimus! Yes, Krimus! Isn't this kind of broken? I'm so happy that I put Valgavoth in here. I mean, the more we have of those, the better, right? The more we have of those, the freaking better. Toby the Beastie Befriender. We don't have a board wipe here, so it's all fine and dandy. Get ourselves another blue source. I want to draw here first and see what happens. Another land. I can get rid of Liliana. The question is, do I play the deadly cover-up? Do I play Valgavoth here? Getting rid of you. I don't want to give him any value. Just passing the turn. This is draw, right? Yeah, draw first. But we can do this in response. Because I will get another treasure. You drove three and a half hours just to do a 15 minute visa meeting for your visa? I mean, the visa is pretty more important than a mother concert. That is all I'm saying here. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I'm gonna bring it in Valgavov now. Now, I kind of want to wipe the board.
<coughs> kind of want to wipe the board here. And see what they have in their hand. Elspeth mightn't get lost. So that's no bueno right now. So I kind of have to get rid of the get lost. I will try that. I will try to get rid of the get lost here. Perfect. They fell right into my trap. Am I still using this though? Yes. Treasure for a treasure. They still fell right into my trap, you know? So that's absolutely alright here. Unless, of course, they have another one. Oh my lord, how many of those do we have? Because I can do this instant speed, I will. I will absolutely do this instant speed. Question is... Have they found another one? The only question that I have. And if they have, they will be second everything here. So that is kind of alright with me. Okay, let us see what we find here. Immodane Recruiter. Not really needed. They need to do a lot here to uh, annoy me. You already lost, now you're doing my friend. They do need to do a lot here to annoy me. Let us see if they can. Split up is pretty good. Split up is exactly what they needed here, to be honest. Okay, alright. Chase is good, though, also. So we can get rid of the Overlord of the Must uh, Mistmore here, which is also pretty good. Just imagine their top deck luck here. Just imagine their freaking top deck luck here. Kind of crazy. But it's fine with me. A deadly cover up. And one reenact the crime. We don't need it anyways. So I think if we're getting rid of the uh, Overlord, we're pretty good here. I mean, what else do they have? Ghostly dancers? Yeah. That's pretty fine with me. Pretty, pretty fine with me. Alright, let's draw here. Another Collector's Vault can go, that will also pump up this, and we're passing. There's the Caretaker's Talent! Kinda useless though here. Just saying. So I played this for three. One, two, three, four. We still have four. We'll mill myself for nine. There is a high chance that we hit something with it. Very good. Very, very good. I can bridge the multiverse. I don't know if we have enough. It depends if we hit another breach. I don't know in the last 10 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We did take the reenact the crime. But no other breach. Crazy. Kinda crazy. Okay. Fine with me, I guess. Boom. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> We're cooking now, baby! We're cooking now! We're up against Adamantul! Oh my lord, Krimus! Yes, Krimus! We just need to reenact the crime somewhere. Oh my god, come on! Double! 
Ley line. Double ley line. Again. And a hard fire hero. What the freaking heck else? Wow, game. Wow. Just wow. Yep, no surprise. The next thing that will happen is a Callus Cell Sword. I'm calling it right now. That is just a game. That is just a game. Now Callus Cell Sword. Boom. Game over. Every single game we played against this deck today, exactly the same. Exactly the same. Ridiculous. Wizards. Wizards. Get your poop together and ban this stupid card. Did not find my removal. I lost the game. <sighs> Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I even went first. I literally even went first. I cannot keep this. I can't keep this. So we could have won last game if I had this, but I didn't. So what was I supposed to do, you know? What the heck was I supposed to do? I don't want another land here. I have the collector's vault. That is good enough. Carrot cake? No carrot cake. If I had this last game, I would have won, you know? But no, but no. Kinda deserve it. Let us see if they have another one, though. Let's just see if they do have another one. There's land. There is creature now. Oh, another land. Okay. Oh, another land. Okay. <laughs> another land. Ridiculous. So we are on one, two, three, seven lands in the first 13 cards again. Leyline of the Void? You must be joking! And I draw another land! Wow! Wow! Okay. Alright. Seems fine. Seems absolutely fine. I mean, yeah, they, they played against Reanimator. It's kind of clear as day. What the heck is going on here? Why is everything land? Why is everything land? Alright, passing the turn here. I can still get back Valgavoth. Why did they not use the Myrix? In a graveyard, though. One more land and I can still play... I can still play Valgavoth. I don't think we will find a land because I threw away so many lands. There will be a time until I do. Still not giving up though. Still not giving up, though. Love Arata and Manifest, and again, Hoposcoop because I looked the third card from the deck. <laughs> I mean, that is kind of kind of evil. Yo, Master Domo, welcome! There is the land that I was hoping for. I'm still breaching here. I'm still doing that. Totally worth it. Totally freaking worth it. Nobody deserves these blades more than Phyrexia. Totally freaking worth it. Okay, all right. Ending the turn here. Let us see what you're doing now, my friend. Let us see what your next freaking plan is here. Absolutely fine with me. I got rid of the ley line. That is all I wanted. That is all I freaking wanted. 
Getting rid of the freaking ley line. Alright, drawing here. Discarding the breach. Reenact the crime. Breach the multiverse. We got rid of their ley line with their own freaking card. That is the best part about it. Uh, daring wave rider. Done. Reenact the crime. Done. Get Valgavoth. Beautiful. Here is Valgavoth again. Make him lose some life. Play this. I wonder what they're going to do next. Who of you beasts gifted me a sub? I don't know. Who gifted a sub? Nobody gifted it today, but uh, might have been happening yesterday or the day before. Do you think they have another Sunfall? Do you think that is just what will happen in here? Yo, Crystal Pool, thanks for giving us up to uh, Gogorov Golgi. Deadly cover up, okay. All right. No worries here. I can still win with the Kaya, and I will win with the Kaya. Don't you worry about it. Wait, what did they get rid of? Jace? They got rid of Jace! What? Okay, get rid of Jace. I don't mind. I do mind. I, I literally do mind. But you know, we can also just find another Bridge the Multiverse here. And then how are we doing it? Double Bridge the Multiverse, I guess? Will that be enough? Let us just hope it will be. Because otherwise I will be slightly dead, so... I have to get rid of you here. What am I even doing? I do have one more Bridge the Multiverse left. do have in here? I don't think we can win. I don't think we can win. We're missing one reenacted crime to win here. We'll see though. Phyrexia shows no mercy, so neither will I. Super close. Them milling Jace was actually the right move. I don't control. I don't control. It was close. I've done my research. It was close. Them getting rid of Jace was the right call. Them getting rid of Jace was the right call. The Leyland of the Void cost me so hard. Plus, you know, double board wipe in a row was also very, very good for them. <gasps> Krimas! Yes, Krimas! I don't think so. I think so here, though. Okay, all right. So... I have to get rid of Jace, right? Yeah. Jace needs to go here. We do have the Anoint with a Fiction, so that is pretty good. That is all I want here. Because 90% of the decks today have been Mono Red. So the Anoint is actually pretty good. Okay, it's not Mono Red this time. 
Interesting. Oh, wait, what? Oh, come on, it's poison again! Like, so many people are playing poison nowadays. It's crazy. It's actually crazy to me. Literally, actually crazy to me. How many people are playing freaking poison? How is that still a thing? Do we need to play poison again? We have to do it. It's so much poison, right? Okay. Alright. We're still looking okay here, though. Let's first do this. I don't think we need to Rona's Vortex. You can go. So one, two, three, four, five, six. If we draw one more land, we're super good. Because then we can start breaching the multiverse. Uh, we're, we're about to do the same here. At least we're trying. At least we're trying hard. We do the freaking same here. Just mirixing it up. And in that case, let's just return this to your hand. Sad for you. Sad. There is Jace now. Let's do this first. I don't need another Collector's Vault. Next turn we can breach the Multiverse. Which is pretty good. I'm not doing anything else here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Alright, draw your cards. They're not doing so well here. They're not doing so well here. Which I enjoy very much. I even have to discard now? We're on two poison. So, yeah. Kind of pretty sure way. Alright, maybe we throw something away that's good. Like this land. We really, really don't need it. And now we're doing this. Let us see what we hit. Come on. My graveyard. Did I even hit anything here? Just another breach. Just another breach. Let's go with Liliana then. Those who get in my way tend to regret it. We hit very poorly here. We hit very, very poorly here. No reenact the crime. Not a single one. That is just bad. That is just very, very bad. Very, very bad. Okay, game. <laughs> All right, game. There is another bridge, though. Getting rid of this. Playing this one like this. Oh, counter spell! Come on! Come on! Oh my god! Okay. But if we draw land here, we have a very, very high chance of winning. A very, very high chance of winning here. If we draw one untapped land. If we don't, we just need to buy ourselves some time. But our opponent is not looking as lucky as they think, you know? We're on four poison. That's absolutely all right. One bring the ending. Do they have more bring the ending? We're just passing the turn here. Yo, Melza Bella, thank you for the follow. And still get rid of this. And we will get rid of it. Don't you worry about that. Pretty certain that they have more counter spells. They play something here, we know they don't. 
Didn't play anything here. So we have not found a single reenactor crime. Right? There's not a single one in here. Okay. Alright. We're going all in then. If they have to bring the ending, they have to bring the ending. I'm not dancing around my unluck anymore. Half of my deck, not a single one of the cards. Half of their deck, all the bring the... I still have not hit a single one? Wait. Have I really not hit a single reenact Oh, I have. I have. Okay. I was just about to say. I was just about to say, have I really not hit another reenactor crime? <coughs> have I really, really not hit another reenactor crime here? That's fine. Another breach. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus! How many cards? Nine. Yo, what was this game? The heck was this game? Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Wowzers. I had to play more than half of my deck to finally hit one reenact the crime? Crazy talk. Crazy talk. Uh, yeah, why not? Why not? It was fun. We're up against Scarpello! How dare you change quest? I always do. I can keep this. This is pretty good. Getting rid of you here. Mono red? Are you mono red? No, you're mono black. Okay, interesting. Well, interesting is a strong word. What do they have here? Glimpse the core! Your ramp! Interesting. Oh, we have Madsen Till here. Madsen Lentley. Madsen Lentley. I, I know how to read this. I just choose to be a little slow about it. That is all. That is all. Don't at me. I'm just returning this to their hand. All we need to do is to buy ourselves time, you know? That is all we have to do. Buy ourselves time. If I draw a land here, that would be very cool. So let's try. I bet they have a cut down. Oh, you can go. You can straight up go. If only I had a land here. If only I had a land here. I could have drawn for a land. What is wrong with me? But I kind of want this. Kind of very, very much want it. Okay. So now we just have to hope that they don't find a bet. What's your most uncomfortable color combo? How do you mean that? The end. Time to see if they have a bet. The end. Crazy. Kind of crazy to me that people are playing that here. The end. For what? It's like the end is making a resurgence. A lot of people are playing the end right now. Which is crazy to me. Absolutely crazy to me. Uh, I think... For me it's uh, Simic. Simic is the color that I have most problems with playing. If they play a bat here, I will still be very saddened. Please don't play a bat. Don't play a bat! That is not a bat. We're shwasting. We are shwasting! Let's draw here. That is super good. All right. A 
Will we reenact a crime? Let us see how far we can take this. What are we milling ourselves? Another bridge! Another bridge was milled! Here's Glisa. Another freaking bridge was milled. So we can reenact the crime here again. Play another bridge the multiverse. Hope to hit good. If not, we're still kind of fine, you know? Um, I need to see if... Uh... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... What is in their graveyard? Only this. Go with Valgavoth here. They have a board wipe, they have it. Not playing around that. If they have exactly a deadly cover up here, they have it. Screw you, game. Screw you. Screw you royally. Screw you royally. Absolutely screw you royally, deck. Just imagine. Just imagine. What perfection. What perfection, you know? What did they get rid of? Reenact the crime? Or breach? Reenact the crime, why? Shuffler used splash. Shuffler is messing with us royally here. Absolutely royally. Passing a turn here. I still do have the breach. So I can still do shenaniganery here, you know? I still do have the breach. Am I drawing here? No. Outrageous robbery. Wow. Okay. They outrageously robbed us. I want to see their hand. I really, really want to see their hand. The one... Six. Get rid of their deadly cover-ups. What is this hand? The heck is this hand? What? What? We're kind of screwed, eh? We're kind of very, very screwed. This is such a shuffler, what is even up with you kind of game. <coughs> if they don't take Liliana here, though, they lose. If they don't take Liliana here, though, they lose. So they have to take Liliana or they lose. Let us see. Let us see if they're smart enough to get rid of my last card in hand. They will be taking Valgavoth. 100%. Told ya. Told ya. Told you they're taking Valgavoth. If they drew a bet here, they're not playing bets. We haven't seen a single bet. They just screwed themselves here royally. Royally. Absolutely royally. And we flipped this, not yet. They just screwed themselves. I love that for us. I really freaking love that for us. I really love that for us. Screw themselves royally. Good game. Good game. Good game. No cards in hand. No deck. No nothing. Just beating them. The old-fashioned way. Way to breach the multiverse. <laughs> if they have a Rona's Vortex here. Oh, okay, that's... It doesn't do anything. Boom. Here I thought we lose. Here I thought we lose. But we won. We beat them. So good. What a game. What a game. What a fun little deck, eh? What a fun little deck. Who would have thought that an otter would still make, have an impact after all this time? Still doing stuff. I did not believe it. I would have told me like two days ago, three days ago, 
four days ago, I would have told you to get the freaking heck out of here, an otter, really. An otter that I have not seen yet, an uncommon even. But here it is. So most of the games we won with Mill, which is kind of to be expected. You know, we've milled him like 20 to 30 cards in one single go. That is already very, very freaking good. Uh, yeah, that area is still new in Redneck. The crime decks popping off left and right is kind of crazy to me. But I kind of love it. So I'm very, very happy with it and I hope you enjoyed it yourself. If you are still here, please put a little daring Malone rider down below in the comments. Just imagine that the otter is like riding me like a surfing board all over the place. That would be very funny if they did. But, uh, you know, that is up to your fantasy. So thank you all so very freaking much tuning in. And remember, my friends, that if you're waking up tomorrow morning and see a beautiful, beautiful face of yours in the mirror, that all of you are pretty freaking sweet. I'm Matt Malone, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Tomorrow.